hub has achieved is to create a community of people that have similar interests uh, research voice but are at very different stages of their career. Also you have the, the senior professors that have been around for a long time and they know exactly what the pressing issues are. And then you have people like myself that are more junior uh, at the beginning of their career and maybe bring some, a bit of fresh thinking uh, to the community. And in these interactions uh, there's a lot of value, there's, uh, there's a lot of uh, good things that come out of these tension fields. For someone who works in industry and that is covering a broad range of different technology areas related to um, automotive transport and energy sectors, and um, certainly in the research I've done in the past looking at hydrogen and fuel cells, I'm very aware that it's one of those topics that is very broad in terms of what it covers. So you've got from all your different methods of how you produce hydrogen, through how you store it and distribute it, to then the end products that you use it in. And it requires a really broad range of skills to be able to um, implement those technologies and infrastructure and services that you're going to need to make it, to make commercialisation a um, possibility. The three white papers that we launched, one on energy systems and hydrogen and fuel cells, one on energy security and hydrogen and fuel cells and one on the economic implications of hydrogen and fuel cells uh, are three of the kind of flagship publications of the Supergen Hydrogen and Fuel Cells Hub and you really do need a broad research partnership of the kind that the, um, that the Hub represents in order to produce documents of that kind that have all the technical skills in engineering, in basic uh, materials, physical sciences, but also which combine the socio-economic dimension so that you can start looking at this set of technologies in the round and work out the full system implications of them. In addition to this, something that's absolutely invaluable or has been invaluable to me through the hub is uh, getting access to, to industrialists. You know, this is something that's extremely difficult for, for an early career academic. The funding that I've received through the Hub is the first funding I've ever got as an independent academic and it makes a massive difference to, to the things that you can do. Uh, you can employ people, you can do research, you can go out uh, and talk to other people about it. Uh, it was uh, instrumental in me attracting additional funding to, to, to build an international, uh, international activity as well. All in all, the Hub was a, was a great experience for me and I hope it can continue this for years to come.